This computer is very important to Canadian researchers. All research today, whether it's in science or in social sciences or even the humanities, more and more using digital resources to simply be able to conduct their, uh, their research. This system is part of a network of computers that are being made available to researchers across Canada under the allocation system run by Compute Canada. Uh, as such, we make it available and, and we have users from coast to coast to coast. We have astrophysicists, we have people who do high energy physics, we have the climate scientists, we have the chemists, um, people who are designing airplanes, we have the biologists doing genomics, uh, with molecular dynamicists, you name it. Our new computer system consists of 1,500 nodes. Each node has 40 cores, bringing this up to 60,000 cores of very fast new technology. The compute nodes are interconnected using Mellanox InfiniBand in a Dragonfly Plus topology. This is a new technology for Mellanox. It uses a technique called adaptive routing. Storage for the new system is based on the Spectrum Scale file system from IBM, which Lenovo has licensed. And then in addition, we have another layer of storage intermediate between the compute and the disk storage, which we call burst buffer. We have a fiber optic connection that goes from here uh, down to the University of Toronto. We had to build our own um, three or four kilometers worth of fiber optic from our data center down to York University, at which point we connect to other fiber that goes straight into U of T. We're currently connected at 20 gigabits per second, and we're expecting that this will go up to about 100 gigabits in the near future. All Canadians benefit because basic research, fundamental research, is so important to the development of what we now call applied research. Without the basic research, nothing can happen. Today, there isn't a single field of research that can happen without high, without high performance computing